Hello guys, in this video, I will be showing you how we can set up different animations in our Android Studio project. So let's start. So open any browser that you are using currently and search Lottie files. And after this, you will see the first website of uh, Lottie files, which is lottiefiles.com. Let's open this. And this is the dashboard of Lodi files. There are features, animations, and you can search here. So let's search for a switch. And here you can see a lot of uh, switch animations and you can use all of them in your Android Studio project. Let's go for this one, which is created by Sonu Muhammad. And after this, you can convert it to GIF. You can download it as a JSON file and you can download it as an MP4 file. Also, you can change the speed. You can change the background color. You can implement in it HTML. You can implement in iOS and Android. And you can edit the layer colors of this animation. We will be downloading it it in json file so let's download it and save it to in desktop now let's download another one let's say error animation so here let's download uh, mm, this one So now our download is done. Now let's click on this uh, Android Studio icon. And here you will see how to set up your project with the Lottie files. And we will be using this dependency in Gradle file. So make sure you copy this. And the latest version is 3.60. So let's move on to the Android Studio. So these are the two files that we have just downloaded from the lottiefile.com website. And uh, we must change na names of uh, these files because Android Studio doesn't like the symbols and numbers in a raw file. Uh, so we will be changing it in Android Studio. So let's copy these files. And let's create an Android Studio project. So let's create a new Android Studio project, uh, select empty activity, click next and let's give it a name. Let's say Lottie animation and let's click finish. So our project is ready. So first thing we have to do is to go to Gradle script and go to build.gradle. So here we will be implementing the Lottie file animation dependency. So let's say implementation com dot dot android Lottie slash the latest version for Lottie animation is 3.60. Maybe you have different one. Now let's sync it. So now the Lottie dependency is installed. Another thing we have to do is to create a raw folder in our resources file. So right click on the resources file, go to new, go to folder and select the raw resources folder and click finish. After this, we can see the raw folder and paste the files that we have just copied earlier, the JSON files. So paste it here, 
So as you can see, this is showing error because of the name. So we have to rename it. So let's rename the file to let's say this is the error. So let's say error, refract it. Now the second one is switch. So let's say switch. Okay, this is showing some error, but let's try again. Mm, switch anim. Now the error is gone. Now we have two JSON files. Now it's time to implement both of these. So let's try the error animation. So first we have to go to layout, go to activity main. Here we will write some code, remove this and change this constraint layout to linear layout and give it orientation vertical and also gravity center. Now we have to implement the lottery. So when we write else, so you will see the code uh, let's say wrap content wrap content now we will call a resource file so let's uh, write a raw lottery raw resources file in this we will give a direction to the raw file so it is in raw and it is error it will be not showing in in our design because when you run it, so then you can see it. So let's close these parentheses and also write a like uh, loop, lottery loop, let's say true. And uh, let's say auto play true. Now, when we run this program, you will see the animation. So let's try to run the emulator. I will be running Pixel 3A API 30. Okay, so let's check our animation if it works. Okay, so the animation is loaded and you can see it uh, is repeating automatically because we have set the loop to true and also when we open the app it automatically plays so we have set uh, you, you have you know that we have set the autoplay to true you can change change it any if you want and let's write some code for switch okay so let's uh, back to the activity main and uh, here we will be doing some changes we will be giving a id so we can find it in a main activity so let's give it id and let's say switch button animation and uh, also remove remove these two tags and change the raw resources to switch anim so now let's uh, go back to the main activity and first we have to make the switch by default off so let's say boolean is switch on is equal to false and now we will be writing some code first we will be Finalizing the Lottie animation view So it will not change. So let's say Lottie animation view and Let's give a value as a, let's say switch Button Is equal to find view by ID or dot ID which we have given the um, switch button animation 
now we have to create our own click listener so let's say switch button not on on click listener let's say new now we will be creating a if and else statement when we click on the switch so it will be turned on and shows the animation and when we click on back so it will be turned off so let's write if this switch on so we will be using the let's say switch button dot set minimum and maximum progress which is the animation let's write it 0 0.5 f f is the speed and write it again switch button dot play animation and let's set the e switch on is equal to false okay now there is else statement so let's write else so let's write switch button dot set maximum and minimum and maximum progress to 0, 0.0 f and the another one is to 0 0.5 f and let's say switch button dot play animation and write a switch on will be true means the switch is on now i think we have we are done here and so let's play our animation Now let's check our animation if it's working uh, right or not. So as you can see this is the switch animation and we have set it by default to the off. So when we click on this button and it will change to on. And when we click in again and it will be turned off. So by this way you can use the Lottie animation. So. Uh, to use a switch and that's it for today thanks for watching and if you are new to this channel please subscribe and uh, i have saw that uh, most of my viewers didn't subscribe like 99 percent so please make sure to subscribe and see you in the next video